What's up guys? Graham here. This is a little bit of an older Warfront, so basically I'm just going to narrate through it. Um, I'm trying to get my live stream footage all put together. I was having a lot of lag issues in the, the live stream, and I think I finally figured out what the issues were. It was me connecting to the wrong servers and stuff like that, so hopefully we got the whole lag issue figured out, and I'll be able to upload more of the live stream footage in the future. This is obviously a very old Warfront, as in around Christmas time, uh, because you can see me trying to pick up the Christmas gift there, as the, which is the stones in this particular Warfront. And, uh, yeah, I'm playing Paragon, which is not the ideal spec to be running in this particular Warfront, because a Reaver would be doing so much more, uh, damage benefit everything in this particular warfront instead of uh, a paragon like i'm running right now and somebody said grim here in the raid warning <laughs> but uh yeah obviously reaver would dot all of these people up over there reduce their healing all that stuff it would make it a super easy match for us but i think at this time i was pretty frustrated with having to run reaver all the time uh, everybody really has been playing range classes so much that at the time I felt like I had to play Reaver over and over and over. And I was getting tired of it. I was getting so frustrated with having to play Reaver that I was like, you know what? I'm running Paragon. I don't care if I die. I don't care if I don't get the heals. I prefer the heals. Hopefully I get them, but you know what? I'm just going to play what I want to play, and Reaver is not going to be it. And that's probably what was going on, what was going on in this particular Warfront. Uh, obviously, Paragon is not going to do too bad once you start establishing dominance like this, to where I can just charge in and smash into these guys like you see happening right now. Yeah, they're they're in a lot of trouble with the Paragon getting on them like that, but. Uh, this is kind of how most Warfronts go, where once one side uh, establishes dominance, the other side uh, really loses motivation and starts going into panic mode. Some of them give up. Uh, some of the people are probably AFK in their spawn right now. And then you get the people that are panicking and going along the sides trying to steal stones, which uh, it looks like one guy tried to steal one right then. Um, and then you got the other people that kind of trickle into the middle. So this is kind of a losing strategy altogether for the enemy team. But they don't have much other recourse except for if they all gathered up before they entered into combat. And that usually just does not happen. Uh, as you can see, they're already kind of uh, going into the fight whenever they should be waiting back and gathering their numbers. But they're not doing that they that's just how people think they they want to get into the fight they don't want to sit back and wait while the enemy team is running stones they want to you know get in there try to mix it up try to pressure but the thing is is you can't pressure if you don't have the numbers so yeah it, it's the classic fault of uh warfront like this to where the losing side is just going to do that. And then you'll probably see people running along the sides to try to steal our stones because that is true panic mode at that point because they they know they cannot get the stones in the middle. They're thinking the only prayer that they have is to steal stones. Uh, so I'm sure you're going to see a player running along the sides to try. Yeah, there you go. So uh, this guy is the same guy that tried to steal the stone earlier and he's trying to steal the stone now. Which, I'm sure our guys will take care of them pretty good. And, as you can see, they're, they're really just filtering in a little bit at a time, which makes it really easy to kill them. Yeah, look at all the guys running along the side trying to steal our stones. And I spot it right there. You see me looking over there at those guys. Yeah, look at all of them running, man. Haha. <laughs> I'm basically chasing this guy thinking, you know, hopefully I can catch up to him. But I guess I realized that I wasn't and there was people right behind me. So, it's kind of like pick them off while I can. Because if I kill them here while they're extremely weakened and not with their group, then whenever we go up and fight their group, it's going to be a lot less people. <laughs>
guy definitely has me focused here. All these other players around, and he's definitely going at me. <laughs> he applauded me after he died. That's pretty funny. Yep, here goes uh, one of the thieves. And if we can get these stones back, we obviously win this match. Which, uh, it looks like one more guy has a stone, and we just got that, so that should be the end of the match right there. Yep, there you go. I hope you guys enjoyed this Warfront. If you did, make sure to hit the thumbs up button. And uh, be sure to tune into the live stream every day at 1 p.m. Central Standard Time. Well, most days, anyway. Uh, and it's at twitch.tv forward slash GrimTheGamer.